I am Michelle Wood. I'm going to show you how to make collage Christmas cards for art gems. So what do you need? So radio recycling for different colour cards and paper, for old magazines, um, for wrapping paper, different colour card. You need some plain card and paper to stick onto, a pair of scissors, glue stick and a pencil. The aim is to keep it simple. So choose simple shapes like triangles, draw them out on your card or paper, draw them in different sizes and then you can cut them out. So the aim is to have lots of repeat shapes with slightly different colours, different size and you've got lots to choose from then. So when you're coming to make your composition you can play with the layout. Just place them on your card, move them around, put smaller ones in the distance and then choose the contrasting colour cards um, or papers to use as well to add a little bit more detail. We've got three different colours so we can test them against the colour of the green and then you're going to cut out smaller shapes just small rectangles to make the base of the tree. Again, cut out several. Just little snippets of paper or card are great. Once you're happy with the layout, you're then ready to glue them in place. So just um, get your glue stick and you can just glue each piece down in turn. Another idea is to use the same shapes but have a different layout. So the triangles are great and you could build a single Christmas tree. Different colour triangles just laid slightly on top of each other. You've got your base here tree and then you could cut out some smaller triangles, play around and overlay these to make um, a star for the, crop, the top of the tree. So it's not quite right first time, just cut another one and then just um, place them, move them around where you want them and stick them down. Another idea is to draw a different shape. This time it's more like an eye shape, um, like an e elongated um, oval shape. Cut these out. And this time we're going to play with overlaying different colours. So we've got different warm colours to play with. We've got some yellows, reds and uh, oranges. Cut out the same shape but different sizes. And then you can lay those on top of each other. And this time we're going to build them up to make um, the flame of a candle. So we've got some lovely hot, hot, warm and hot colours there. And just placing them um, one on top of the other but for different sizes you can um, you can get this lovely flame effect so then the base is just a simple rectangle and again play with sizes and if you've got repeats um, they look great there's a bit of dynamic there with those repeated shapes and um, ideas you can also make it with the patterned paper so um, you can cut out bits of colour that you like from magazines or if you've got some origami paper they're lovely to use as well. You just need little little tiny pieces and just you can play around. If you want to then stick them on the card, make your own card by folding some paper in half. Again play with the layout, you can move them around at this stage. So you could uh, put them where you want. When you're happy, again, you could then stick them down. And yet another idea. Last idea is to play with some circular shapes. So this time we're making a, a little round robin. Um, and again, you can add different shapes. So obviously we've got a little triangle for his beak. Um, you can cut out kind of twiggy shapes for his feet, long leggy robin, and um, those eye shapes for the wings. But use the snippets too, don't throw anything away, because you can really play with those. 
So I hope you've enjoyed it. Have a lot of fun making your own Christmas cards and have a wonderful Christmas.